ET200S pairs of 4-bit digital modules on separate bytes into a single byte. First, select your station and double click Hardware. In the Hardware configuration, select the ET200S station. In this ET200S station, all the digital inputs and output modules are assigned to separate bytes. The first two digital input modules are assigned to bytes 4 and 5. Let's combine them into a single byte. First we have to set the address. Double click on the first digital input module. Select the address tab. We will set the input address to 10. Click OK. With the first digital input module highlighted, hold down the shift key and click on the second digital input module. Click the pack address button. Both of the modules have now been combined into a single byte with input address 10. Let's combine the first two digital output cards. Double click the first digital output card address byte 0. Choose the address tab and set the output address to 10. Click OK. With the first digital output module highlighted, hold down the shift key and click on the second module. Click the pack address button. In the two previous examples, we set the address first and then pack the bytes. This time let's pack the bytes first and then set the address. Highlight the first digital input module, address byte 6. While holding down the shift key, click on the second digital module, address byte 9. Click the pack address button. Both modules have been combined into byte 6. Double click the first DI module, address byte 6. Click the address tab and change the input address to 11. Click OK. Let's do the final two digital output modules, currently bytes 2 and 3. Highlight the first digital output module address byte 2. Hold the Shift key and select the second digital output module address byte 3. Click the Pack Address button. The two modules have been combined into byte 2. Double click on the first DO output module address byte 2. Click on the Address tab and change the output address to 11. Now the first set of digital input and output modules have been combined to input and output address 10. And the second set of digital input and output modules have been combined to input and output address 11. Click the Save and Compile button to save the changes and get them ready for downloading to the PLC station. After making changes to the hardware configuration, you'll need to download it to the PLC. This concludes the video on combining ET200S pairs for 4-bit digital modules on separate bytes into a single byte.